We start with the driver who did not survive a crash this morning when his car slammed into the rear end of a trailer on the northeast side. It all happened at the intersection of Loma Azul and Topperwine. That's west of I-35. San Antonio police tell us that driver was speeding near a neighborhood. Stephen Gavasso shows us the scattered damage and the tragedy left behind. We got a sedan that's driving westbound on top of one, high rate of speed, and we've got a, a tractor trailer that's pulling out of a private drive. And the outcome was deadly. San Antonio police and other emergency crews arrived here to the intersection of Loma Azul and Topperwine early Friday morning. Police tell us the driver of the sedan had to be extracted from the car after he crashed into the rear end of the trailer, which was carrying two vehicles. The, the driver of that, that, that trailer did his very best to get those vehicles off and render aid to uh, the the, the driver of the sedan. Crews were able to get him out, but he was rushed to Bamsey, but died on the way. Topper wine remained blocked for several hours. It's taken two wreckers to wedge that vehicle out of the trailer right behind me. This is here on Topper Wine, where there is still scattered debris following that deadly crash from this morning. While speed is believed to be a factor, the investigation is still in the early stages. From our investigation, it does look like tragic accident. The Bear County Medical Examiner has not released the name of the driver that was killed in the crash. Stephen Cavasso's KSAT 12 News.